Alright, so it shouldn't take too long to get here. We shall sail through the night. And are you... yes. You're actually on the ship. That's good. Yeah, I've had, I have had people randomly disappear, so... Yeah, that's a thing. Right, we've got a weapons place. Another cat. Food, and we have a skill place. We'll have a look at this. If we can buy the cannon... cannoning... cannoning skill? I don't know. <laughs> cannon... cannon mastery, that's it. Uh, map awareness, I would really like that. Yay, cannon mastery. Okay, map awareness, cannon mastery. Du, 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 du. We've already got fishing and stuff like that. Uh, we got some ultimate skills that we can't afford. Uh, we've got plenty of bandages. So let's sell these kabooms. I could sell that, but... I mean, you know, like, eventually we'll give it to someone, I think. I don't understand the point of this love letter. Female pirates are attracted to you. I don't get that. Uh, we got five pearls, good lord. Awesome, right. Uh, I don't know, it's not even worth anything, so I guess I'll just keep hold of it. Maybe I will figure out its use at some point. But um, until then, we'll just have a look in the weapon shop. Uh, let's have a look at the food shop as well. We might be able to buy some meat. Yes. I'm not going to buy fish on principle of the fact that we have a fisher. So we'll check out the weapon shop and see if you have a fishing rod. You don't. You do not. Ah, what a shame. But you do sell tomahawks, which are pretty bloody awesome. Throwing daggers. No, you see, they're nowhere near as good, are they? Uh, nope. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think we're doing okay, though, with the weapons that we've got. And we will actually get some drops of those at some point, if we, especially if we keep uh, battling tribal guys. Yeah, we'll definitely get some drops on those. I'm going to have another look at the skills, because I've got so much money. Uh, what else could I get? Uh, ship plunderer would be quite nice, and treasure coins as well. And I should probably hire some more crew, because, uh, <laughs> I mean, like, I can give all the skills to one person. I mean, I could give most of them to the captain, because, I mean, if I lose the captain, it's game over anyway, but... Yeah, if I give it to a member of the crew and they die with, you know, a million skills, then that's going to be horrible. Okay, let's go check out the neutral danger, and hopefully it's fishermen, and hopefully they drop a fishing rod. It may be somebody uh, with, like, much superior weaponry than us, but I doubt it. It's usually fishermen. Okay, uh, let's have a look. Let's engage them. Rog. It is fishermen, and there's two of them. Right, we are going to uh, ruin your day. We might actually get some fish from this as well. Yeah, I'm not going to bother telling them to focus the fire. They've got fishing rods. <laughs> there we go. Bloody hell. You knocked that guy for six. Alright. Uh, did we get anything from that? I was not paying attention. What a surprise. Well, we didn't get a fishing rod. But let's just see... Do you have enough to learn Ship Plunderer? Where is it? You do, actually. So I might as well give you that. Before we plunder the ship, there's nobody left over there. Kaboom! 115 gold. Well, that didn't really uh, do much, did it? Um, well, we just wiped the floor with them, so I'm guessing Pirate Danger 2s will be quite easy as well, but... So we've got a tavern there, so we don't want to go too far away from that. That's sailing back the way we came, isn't it? No, I don't want to do that. We'll go to this Pirate Danger 2 here. This is the first one, and hopefully the crew manages themselves quite well. This is going to be great. It really is. We're going to slaughter some people. It's going to be just awesome. Right, uh, just want to drop some meat in this barrel. There we go. Somebody practice your cooking skill. Who is it? That guy. 
Right, interact. I don't need to see. Oh my word. Uh. <laughs> right, everybody just sort of group up at the front of the ship. Get up there. Oh, don't fall in the water. Right, come over here. Right, being fat doesn't stop them from uh, getting along the grappling hook at the right speeds. That's nice. Okay, everybody. Whoa! That was awesome. Go on, knock him off the edge. <laughs> that was just. Poke! <laughs> oh no! Right, well, that's one of them dead. Right, everybody gang up on this guy now. Try not to bunch up so they uh, can't see you. Oh, who did you just. Right, uh, uh, no idea. Well, there's only two of them now. Could be alright. Just gonna get knocked in the sea. Bloody hell. We just absolutely massacred them. Right, back to the ship. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really matter how many crew you have. Until you get to ships that have cannons, you can just sort of slaughter everybody, because they're all a little bit stupid. And they'll just watch their shipmates get absolutely annihilated. There's no treasure chests. No plunder that. We got some more meat. I'm not going to ask where they got the meat from. I mean, I guess maybe they brought it with them, but... Uh, yeah. Yeah, that probably makes sense, actually. Right. I'm going to make my way to the town called Mexican Hats via these pirate ships. Save my game. We will be good friends, Balthier Russo. Yeah, until he decides to not pay your wages. Right, okay, you just hit... well, I don't know who just hit level 15. So they're all on level 15. Uh, I would like to give you guys some skills, but I don't know. It doesn't matter who has the treasure coins skill. It just... it's... Uh, it's shared throughout the crews. So I'll give you map awareness. I, don't know, I will save the cannoneering skill for the captain. Because it seems only fair that he gets to use the big guns. Right. Uh, only two of them? Okay. Off we go. Try not to get knocked off the ship. Nice. What was that? Oh, I think it was a rock, wasn't it? There we go. That was easy enough. Back to the ship. Uh, let's make sure we get all of the loot. So they had some uh, fruits and some fish. I'm going to need some more barrels, I think. And thunder! 94 gold, okay. I didn't get any food there, did I? Nope. Okay, uh, which one to go through? Uh, da, 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 da. I will go to this one. And... Then on to the town of Mexican Hat. And if it's not a town uh, built in the shape of a sombrero, I'll be disappointed. Is it a tiny ship? <laughs> it's like someone's just sort of floating around a little toy ship ahead of uh, our ship. Nice, okay. Not many of these. Oh, oh, oh. easy now. Oh, don't stand there. Oh, I'm absolutely terrified of them jumping off the ship. Because they do it so often. There we go. Back to the ship. Okay. What do we get? Gold. Gold. Lovely gold. And... Oh, we've got some more meat. That's good. Although while he's cooking it, uh, nobody can eat it. So if I keep adding it... Oh. Is it full? Get off my cursor. Did it crash? No. Yeah. yeah, I have had a weirdness before where I couldn't get out of the menu. Huh, maybe I can't put it in there while he's cooking. That's a bit strange. Alright, so let's see what Mexican hats has to offer. Save the game. Yeah, we have nearly 4,000 gold. Alright, did you get enough? Nope, not yet. Need 15 TP to make him learn the cannon cannon mastery skill. And then we can actually go buy some cannons and start blowing some crap up. Yeah, it's a bit early for it really. But um alright, we got some oysters over here. Let's just see if I can get both of them with this. No, no we can't. Worst interface ever. 
Alright, you've gone straight to attack him. Nice. I thought maybe for a second you were going to uh, upgrade your weapon. Because they do that occasionally. Uh, there is the first mate skill. I've also experienced some strangeness with this. Uh, where eventually the first mate will get the little captain symbol above their head. And then you have to have both of the captains in a shop to be able to buy stuff. I don't know if that's intended or whether that was a bug, but it was very, very strange and quite annoying, honestly. Uh, toilet study. That would be kind of nice, actually. It just seems like a bit of a trivial skill, you know? Especially when we have a uh, cleaning skill. Oh, I don't know. So many. I think we'll go with ship repair. Might be useful at some point. And I'll get a combat evasion and a counter attack. Ah, oh, I'm just spoiled for choice, really. So many skills, got so much money. It's pretty awesome. Um, combat focus plus critical chance. Eh, yeah, why not? Okay. And I can probably make the money back with the pearls that we're about to get. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. If we're getting any pearls. Uh, any pearls? No? Oh, okay. Alright, let's see. Do you sell fishing rods? No. Do they sell them at weapons shops? I'm pretty sure that they do, but... Have a knife. Uh, ooh, they do have a mini pistol, though. Now, those are pretty awesome. Three damage. Yeah, they're not as good as the tomahawks, though, really, are they? I think... I uh, I don't want to just sort of, like, foolishly spend my money. Is there another oyster there? Ah. Come on. Attack the bloody thing. Oh, there's another two as well, I think. They're all kind of squished up on the same tile. These are some crazy oysters. Okay. Are there any oysters? Any pearls? Any? Oh, there's one. Get it, get it, get it. Hey. Okay, you guys get back to the ship. There's no tavern here, there's no free booze. Alright, sell. My god, I've got so much stuff now. Alright, I'll sell that. Blah blah blah. I think that's enough. We have so many grindstones, but I just don't want to use them on these lower level weapons that we have at the moment. So, yeah, that's a thing. Oh, you. You're going to be the death of us. I mean, the amount of time it takes him to uh, get onto the ship, everybody loses morale, and I don't know. Right, where to next? I think uh, down here. Mutual danger to... I don't know, I want to kind of start heading back to the north so that we can go back to this tavern and top up our morale, so we'll go through these pirates. Sing as a song, Mariner. No? Oh, okay. Obviously too miserable, being stuck out at sea with a couple of smelly pirates. Okay, let's see, what do we have here? Still only two of them? Oh no, there's four of them. <laughs> oh! Alright, you guys just... no. No. They won't attack you. Okay. Alright, oh, you've done it now. Alright, get... Yep, there. I feel like this interface could do some work. Okay, there's one dead. Oh, you've just instantly started attacking that guy. I appreciate your enthusiasm, but you don't want to give me a heart attack. Alright, we'll just leave him to it now, we should be fine. And dead. And dead. Alright, you guys back to the ship. Well, the captain counts all of the gold. And deducts 20% when uh, trying to figure out how much those guys get. Not that they get anything, actually, thinking about it. What's that? Ooh, a talisman of hate. That's another thing that I don't fully understand. Uh, where is it? See, it says minus one max morale each hit. But I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Because, I mean... Like, it takes less to top up their morale if the max morale is lower. 
but then similarly it takes I don't know how it uh, deducts morale over time I don't know whether it's a percentage or whether it's a steady rate like minus three per minute or whatever so I don't know if that's a good thing but it does give you quite a big uh, quite a big damage bonus so I'll give it to the captain anyway because their morale is so easy to top up with just a tiny little salary so yeah plus three damage they're gonna be just murderizing people left and right that's pretty awesome uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give you combat focus as well I know I was saving for the cannons but it's probably worth it in the uh, in the long run okay you can't learn anything neither can you uh, didn't forget anything over there under the ship and on to the next one we are becoming quite the murderers right save the game 10 parts acquired nice yeah we'll start building the ship up soon I think I think once we once we have somebody who knows how to use cannons and we buy the uh, actual cannons is there just two of them? there literally is okay over here yeah once we once we actually have cannons we'll um wow you just nearly killed that guy by yourself Balthier you are completely badass with that talisman right now but yeah, so once we have cannons, we can... Right, I've got to wait for this guy to get off. We can build up our ship to actually look like a proper pirate ship. Ooh, we got a looter's cap. Um, well, you got that eye patch. You're always the one to run out of morale first, even though you have that thing. Hmm. That makes me wonder. Oh, we got a, a ginger beard as well. Plus four morale when attacking. We have so many awesome passive items and only three crew. Right, you guys have eye patches. Get more gold from killing pirates. You're gonna have that. And because I don't think these things are working. I mean maybe they are and maybe that's why we haven't had any mutinies yet, but Alright, get over it. And thunder. We got some meat, good stuff. Let's get that in the barrel. Right, uh, it's not, it's not working again, that's not, oh it is full this time, okay. I apologize game, for assuming you were being annoying. Right, we're going to go back to this town and visit the tavern. Well, I said we were coming to this island uh, to visit the tavern and you know, I figured that was a decent place to end the episode, so I just stopped recording. I didn't want to commentate over that long journey. And, yeah, I got to the island and I clicked... They were all on the ship. I clicked Exit Game, uh, because we're here. We're at the island, so it would save. And as the game was exiting, they decided to grapple onto the island. And as I feared, it has saved with our crew in the middle of drowning horribly so uh, I just thought that I would record this so we gotta decide who we wanna save now because we have a life boy um, a life boy I suppose I mean there is a phoenix room as well resurrects pirate after fatal damage to 1 HP well I'm gonna give you uh, I'm going to give the life boy to you. I think you are the better one. You don't have uh, fatness like this person. Uh, yeah, you've just been annoying me for a long time. So, you get to have the life boy. Uh, where the hell did it go? Ah, oh, there it is. Right, and you. Well, I'm going to attempt to give you the phoenix rum. I don't know if it'll work, but... Um Oh, come on! You've got to be shitting me! <laughs> you f Come on, really? Is that on the ship? You son of a bitch. Okay, uh, the other guy died. And... Yeah. Yeah, my crew's dead. 
And oh, I should have taken their weapons off them. Well, bugger it. Okay, we're back to square one in the next episode, but at least our captain is a total badass, so... Did I at least get that phoenix run back? No, of course I didn't. Uh, thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.